So here we go, second part of the uh, tweet behind the scenes, and John is about to show us a bit um, of the control, well, how do you call it? Uh, control desk, um, I like to call it a turret because it spins around. It's the rotating it's turret. The TD station. We used to be called board ops, but now we decided <laughs> that's just not elaborate enough, so now we're technical directors. <laughs> Right. Titles, it's everything is about titles. So over here we have the lighting board, and I can change the color of the background over there. There are colored lights. Turn around and you can see the TNT set. I can change its color. Normally the TNT set is blue. Oh, so, so let, let me see how you, how you do this. This is just a, a DMX lighting board, right? Right. So every, this is the round table set, the living room set, the TNT set, the, ham, the radio corner set. Um, this doesn't have enough controls for us. We need to get a bigger board. We need uh, to we get a bigger ship. We don't have control over everything we need to control. <laughs> All right. We have our chase lights, and I can turn the chase lights off, and I can make them chase. Ooh. So the lighting board, the TriCaster control surface. So we do all our video switching with the TriCaster. That's what these two monitors are. These two monitors over here are controlled by this keyboard and mouse, and it's just a computer that we do our email on, bring up screen captures, but right. it also has VidBlaster on it. Sometimes we need a second video switching device upstream of the TriCaster, so we use VidBlaster, and that can feed into the TriCaster. So these, these are pretty much all the different inputs and cameras that are active and you have them on here and you can, you can switch them to the mainstream and... Uh... Yeah, so the TriCaster has eight inputs. So you see these eight cameras are the ones that Leo is working with now as he's producing the tech guy. But we have over... We have a 72 input, 144 output video hub and I have filled up 68 of the inputs. When I build this final set over here, I won't have any more video inputs and we'll have to do something else. So this will so be full. control surface for the TriCaster. Over here we have the audio mixing board. Digital audio is very cool. This is the uh, display for the audio board. And then this display goes to this keyboard and this mouse and it has eight different things in it. This KVM lets us hook up all four of our Skype machines. Oh, these are the Skype machines? Yeah. And then we have the record. This is where we're actually recording the program that's going to be edited with this Final Cut machine. Um, and this is the uh, machine the, that has the Wirecast that's actually streaming out to our partners right now. So all of that is controlled on this one monitor, this one keyboard, with this 8-port KVM. Wow. These are very cool, these SmartView Duos, because they have SDI in directly. I don't have to buy an SDI to HDMI converter, and you'll see those around our studio. No computers here. All control surfaces except this iPad. This iPad is what controls the video. Card. Oh, so, so the, the actual horsepower is somewhere else. Everything goes, all the wires go down through that hole. Okay, let's, let's, um, let, let's follow that hole and come up in the third part. And let's see where these cables go. Ooh. 